It's day one of the House of Representatives public hearing in the Southeast Zone, a crucial part of the exercise to amend the 1999 Constitution. The two-day exercise holding in Enugu, which is also the center for delegates from Anambra and Ibon states. The state governor, Ifai Uguay, Deputy Minority Leader Toby Okechuku, other House of Representatives members, State Assembly members, representatives of civil society organizations, and other delegates are here. For five minutes. Declaring the public hearing open, Governor Uguay says he hopes the exercise will help produce a constitution which guarantees an egalitarian society. I specifically declared our fervent support to amendments in our constitution that will enhance the unity and prosperity of Nigeria. The deputy minority leader assures all delegates that their contributions will be reflected in the working documents to be considered by the Ninth Assembly. On our part, we assure you that your views will count. Again, the issue of gender equality and diversity comes to the fore, and this participant is clear about her expectations. Provide for gender diversity in legislative leadership and executive positions and for related matters. The House of Representatives is also executing the regional public hearing on the Constitution in the Southwest, and Ondo State is hosting participants from Ekiti and Oshun states. As a curtain raiser, Honorable Peter Apatterson says it is crucial to re establish the terms on which the federating units in Nigeria will continue to coexist and encourages participants to make their inputs. The way out of this situation that we currently find ourselves in the country is to look at the very basis for our coexistence as a nation, to look at the rules governing our social contract with a view to bringing about practical changes. For this traditional ruler, it's important to revert to earlier constitutional provisions on the Council of Traditional Rulers. Before 1999 constitution, you have established a Council of Traditional Rulers. But under the present 1999 constitution, there is no such thing in the constitution. And that is why we've been advocating all along that they should be brought back to the constitution. There is also a call to allow for local government representation in the Federal Account Allocation Committee, as well as proposals for a unicameral legislature in order to avoid wastage. Last week, we made presentation to the Senate. I thought that was all. They are both National Assembly. This week, the House of Rep, they are doing their own. You can see the area of wastage. As the National Assembly continues to mop up inputs from Nigerians across the country, citizens hope the exercise will culminate in a much-desired socio-economic change.